coming to you with a important update. These are the counts per minute that are in my house, about 32 counts per minute. So I haven't checked our AC air filter in the past few months. And that's my air filter right there. And about two months ago, we, we did have high radiation readings in the Metro Miami area. 600 counts per minute were reported. Who knows what Geiger counter that was, however, this is a Inspector Plus. And as you can see, it's definitely higher than the background in my house, which was at around 28 to 30 counts. So we're about five times above almost six times above the radiation in the house. So what is this telling us? Definitely that there's radiation in our air. Just another wake up call. You need to be changing out these AC air filters constantly. I would get the highest grades available. Make sure you get the smallest microns because uh, definitely this is in our house. Radiation in the house. I don't have a basement. This filter is probably about two months old. Let's right, move away from that filter. Radioactive AC filter. So, just another reminder you want to get HEP air filtration in your house. I recommend every bedroom should have a HEP air filter because if your air filter is not catching it, maybe your lungs are, and then your lungs become a filter. And with radioactive particles, who knows what kind of particles these are? I don't think it's just read on here, guys. I think it's more than that really so who really knows I've been you know in the search for people that can do some accurate radiological testing Clean and green, huh? Nuclear clean and green, you think so? Clean and green? You're gonna need all that green to pay for your medical bills. That's what it is. 186 counts per minute right here. 100 CPM is considered emergency to vacate the area at 100 CPM. This isn't a Mickey Mouse guide counter. This is a pretty accurate guide counter right here. So you tell me. You think this is just radon? I don't think so. Radon's a gas anyway. <laughs> 